I hate traveling. I love new places, I love new experiences, but the process just gets me so worked up and anxious. Chelsea made a really good observation once. I have a really hard time differentiating between what's probable and what's possible. I'm the kind of person who's always thinking about all the possible outcomes and the contingency plans, but then I forget to think about which ones are likely to happen and which ones aren't likely to happen. It's not that I think something bad's gonna happen. I just think that if there's something bad that could happen, it's just as likely to happen as something good that can happen. And even though in my experience, things have usually gone right, I still have this crazy idea that it might all go wrong and I get all worried about it. And it's not just travel. I have a few things like this. I like sleep, but not sleeping. I like food, but not eating. I like being places, but I really don't like going places. Anyway, I'm in Washington, D.C. Actually, I think I'm in Arlington right now to meet with a client. And even though it was a smooth process yesterday, yeah, my flight was a little delayed, but it all went fine. But the process of getting packed and getting to the airport, it just feels like such an ordeal. So we'll see how today goes, and I'll check in later. deserted escalator. So I thought I'd tell you how it went today. A really good meeting with a client. I co-facilitated a workshop. It was great. Um, yeah, it was really good. It was, uh, it was tiring. It was a lot of work. I'll continue in a moment. You know, the problem is that I get so worked up and anxious about these things ahead of time. But then when they're done, I feel great. It was such a, it was a good feeling. Everyone was really engaged. I wish I could remember how I feel right now when I'm going into these things, but the problem is I get so worked up about uh, traveling, about meeting new people, about looking foolish, whatever it is, and I feel great now. So, gotta figure out a way to hold on to that. And of course, my flight's delayed again, because that's just how it goes, but it's okay. The moving walkway is ending. Yeah, my flight was delayed <clears throat> in uh, Dulles, and that's okay. It just means that I have less time to wait when I'm in Toronto. I was worried I wouldn't even get there today, but um, looks like I will, so that's good. And yeah, so I'm gonna go to my gate, try to figure out how to remember this feeling next time, and uh, yeah. It's really weird. That hallway is really empty. 